Jeff, everything about what happened here tonight was horrible and senseless. And just to give you an idea as to how deeply this has affected people, a little while ago we saw a woman come by here and leave some of these little flowers and candles, and there were tears in her eyes. And naturally, we asked her, "Did you know this young woman who was killed?" And she said she didn't, but she felt so badly about what happened. She was taken by surprise and violently attacked. This security video shows the 32 year old woman being tackled by a man in a hoodie. He tries to grab her purse, but she fought back. That's when police say one man dragged her and ran her over in a getaway car. We aren't showing you those final violent moments on air. Her sister ran to help her, but it was too late. The sister stayed with her at by her side, crying hysterical. She wasn't the only one watching this horror unfold. The three suspects were already being followed by undercover officers from the LA County Sheriff's Department. The men were wanted for several other crimes in the LA area. The question now, what did those undercover officers see and when did they see it? I don't know if they exactly saw the robbery happened, but they rolled up right after or during the robbery when things were going down. It happened so fast, the woman was run over. They fled the scene, and that's when they called us to help out with the pursuit. They chased the suspects down the 22 freeway and all the way to South LA to Century and the 110 freeway. Those suspects were booked for murder in the Orange County Jail. And as for those undercover officers, we were really curious about how this could have happened with them so close by. What did they see and when did they see it? And we wanted to ask those questions to the LA County Sheriff's Office. We reached out to them, but we still have not heard back tonight. Reporting live from Garden Grove, Sarah Donchi, KCAL 9 News.